Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Nothing To Everything and today is the day that we open everything that we got in the Grand Tour and the Mischief Tour. Um, I don't know how long this will <laughs> sort of take because um, you know, I gotta get it over eight minutes so I get my um, mid rolls so I can get a bit of money in. But yeah, um, we have got all of this stuff to open and we'll get all of the items from these and then see what we actually get. Um, so let's first of all collect these two items, which is the uh, No More Robots Amateur Tour, which is the uh, helmet and the goggles. That is very nice indeed. I'll be taking those. Um, then we've got to the window to the wall, these will be all grey items, I'm pretty sure. So this will be. A Christmas gift, nice. Um, like the black onyx pants, so those are like the normal ones that you usually get. 10,000 reps. Uh, oh, that's actually not too bad. That's quite a good item. Well, at least I think it is. Uh, just a pair of jeans, I guess you could see. Um, these ones, which are just the pink ones, like the pink default pants. Uh, the training was worth it. Uh, nice, that's not bad at all. Uh, I don't know why people are struggling with that one. I'm pretty sure that's the one where you got to train, uh, jump over the train in Stoker. That's super easy. Just wait until the train comes. When you see the train, jump over it, and you should be done. And then if it doesn't trigger, uh, I'm sorry, but I have no idea why it's not working. I want to break free. Oh, the blindfold. Very cool. I might put that on, actually. That's one of my favorite little items. That is a grey one, because it's just cool, you know? You're running around blindfolded because you're that good at the game. Um, what's this one? All of these. Uh, I almost thought it said furry, and that was going to be that like, cringe, but no. Um, nice one. And then we got the rubber ducky. Right, next tour, um, which is the power-up audio one, uh, which is people that made the soundtrack for this game. So I'll take this uh, helmet and this set of goggles and then we've got, I'm not sure if these are still grey or they're uh, uncommon, green ones. Uh, 5,000 rep in a single combo at the Mega Ramp. Okay, these are still grey items. The Mohawks, you don't see those very often. I don't know many people that even put those on. And um, Default lime shorts, uh, default pink shorts, uh, the bear head. Um, I think these were going for the sort of like uh, you know in like steep where you've got the sort of like outfits that are like these uh, But uh, instead of them being like that's the whole outfit They've also included it so your helmet's on show uh, which is still kind of cool I guess it makes it sort of unique rather than copying I guess from another game, but that's what it's meant to be um, Basic black t-shirt uh, basic red goggles basic blue shorts and basic yellow pants. Um, I'm not sure what this one, this might be the green section. Uh, Stoker Air, the one that everyone struggled with for a very long time, but this is the uh, the music people, not the audio, the people that made the sound. This, this, so this is people that made the music, the people before the power-up audio, those are the people that make the, fo like the Foley artists, that's what they are, I guess. Um, I'll be taking that, it's quite a nice one, and quite a nice set of vocals as well. Uh, Stoker Air, Okay, these are the green items. We've got the coffin, uh, which is a little antenna. We've got the food spear journey, but, but um, words beer jersey, very nice. Um, a fade SRS helmet. We've got the Ohio one, or it's the OHO one, uh, on stream today. Back at the ranch. Uh, okay, the sort of semi basic sort of bottoms, I guess, in sort of like a grey white. Here with snow goggles. These are a community item, which is very nice. Uh, I think so actually, I could be wrong though. Um, polka dot shark pants, so they're completely basic. Um, I, if you've seen any of my other videos, these are the most lazy items in the game. As you can quite clearly see, they just textured this blue and that was it. Um, not a big fan of those items because of how easy they were to make. Uh, oh, high voltage goggles, very cool. They're actually quite nice on their own. They actually look really good on their own, I didn't never knew that. Uh, they're actually quite cool, or just on their own. Oh, and then I might put this t-shirt on. Uh, the Howl Noir jersey because it doesn't have a back graphic, but uh, I think it will mess up the outfit that we've got going on, but it's still pretty nice. Right, uh, this is the Rage Squid Amateur Tour. Obviously, you get the Rage Squid helmet, which is really nicely designed. I think this looks great. Same with the goggles, they also look very cool. Uh, bike out again, so this is going to be another set of green items. Uh, basic, basically, purple helmet, uh, basic jersey. Oh, that's actually quite nice because it's like silver and then it's just got this like blue sort of like accent to it. That looks really cool. I do actually quite like that. I think these bikes are very underrated. If you want like a quite nice looking bike that's sort of like a, say you'd get one IRL. It looks basically like this. I think these look very cool. Right. 
uh, we love you, which is from putting in a code. Um, the 42 royal goggles, so just some purple ones. Speed demon, we get some headshot goggles. These are cool because they've got like a crack in the lens. The the person who designed the headshot outfit did a really good job because all of the stuff looks really cool and it's really nicely detailed. So whoever made that, shout outs to you because you did a great job. Uh, training at Stoker, uh, the Lynx set of bikes, I think these look incredibly ugly. I don't know what it is with the colour schemes, this one's actually not too bad, but most of the Lynx colour schemes are absolutely hideous, the eyes. Oh, it feels like I want to just pour bleach in my eyes, it is, it is not very nice looking. These are very nice, uh, like a flannel shirt, Hipwood green jersey, thank you very much for that, that's quite nice. Unlock Career Plus gets us some Hipwood Magma Jersey, uh, Magma Goggles, I don't know why I said Jersey, very nice. Right, what we got next, no more Robots Pro Tour, so this should be the rare items. Um, this is a nice little outfit, I actually think this one looks really nice, good detail, nice design, looks really good. Oh, and we also got the No More Robots Short Jersey, which is quite nice, it looks like a bunch of leaves. I don't see many people even use that, so that one's quite cool. Right, become a pro. Hellwave pants. These look great. If you like vaporwave type beat stuff, Hellwave is definitely very nice. Um, what we got here? The Rascal helmet. This is what someone was wearing today with... Um, they had like a a green Lux bike, they had the green Lux trails and they had the Razor gear on. This was a really nice outfit. Sorry for hitting my mic there. Uh, this was a really nice outfit that they had on. It's some real good descender strip right there. Count sleep without on nightlight. This is a hideous t-shirt. Why the hell would you want this? Just sausage. Very nice. Um, the arrow jersey. These are really nicely designed. Like all of the arrows fit uh, nicely into each other. Whoever designed this, once again, great job. I could never even come close to doing something this like cool looking. Uh, shoot for the moon jump. Super easy one. As once again, my least favorite things ever. The polka dots flamingo jersey is just textured pink, and it looks just is bad like it is the most low effort item ever how is that any interesting at all um oh another hell wave one with a floor the isn't it called like the floor the lee or whatever i think of it as the saints row logo um but the, it's, it's nice nice vaporwave type beat stuff what we got here high voltage shorts very nice indeed uh some food i i mean i guess thanks for that um up next the power a power up audio tour uh this outfit's okay i mean it's quite basic but it's still quite nice anybody home hell track bike this is a really cool bike i think this is a very underrated bike and i'd like to see more people ride it it looks really good it's probably one of my favorite community bikes i think it just looks amazing it's a really nice color scheme it just looks great uh some more goggles uh 42 ultra ones they're pretty dead uh, this is a cool bike because the spokes light up. Um, this is a really nice factory bike. I think there's another color of this as well, but these look really good. These are really, most of the community items, the people that made them did really, really good jobs on these. They look really nice. Um, oh, these are the igloo pants. The, the igloo bike's actually quite nice as well. It's, it's just quite nice, I guess. High voltage bike. So this is like, B. this is like, a, a Lux bike if it was made slightly differently, but I'll take this. This is a cool, this is basically a Lux bike. So with the Aura bike and this bike, these are the only two bikes that fully glow inside of the community section. This is a very, very nice bike. If you want a better yellow looking Lux bike, this is the one that you go for. You don't actually go for the Lux bike, you go for this one. Because this race yellow, or whatever it is, I guess that's what you call it in GTA. But this brighter yellow looks very, very nice indeed. Right, uh, psychedelic pants, these are quite nice if you'd like a grey sort of circly fade. I think that looks nice. Uh, rosy jerseys, so that's pretty cool. I suppose they work a lot better if you're rosy. Um, an item that literally just disappeared off screen, so thanks very much for that. I'll take a no item whatsoever. Right, on to the extraordinary items and the power-up audio, or the Li Liquid City ones, the people that make the Liquid Drum and Bass tracks. Right, first extraordinary item, Lux Spike. Thank you for giving me the most hideous jer jersey ever, and I absolutely hate it. What a complete waste. Oh, another Lux Lent and Helmet. Very nice. Thank you very much indeed. First Lux Spike. Oh, okay. Full green jersey. Thank you very much for that. What we got next? Uh, Golden Times one. This is a shout out to someone, isn't it? I think these were what they used to make like shout out jerseys like you know where you put in a code for like Sam Table is one now. They used to have they used to be extraordinary items before they got added in. 
Uh, give me Lux Spike. Okay, I'll take a Lux Descent Helmet. Giving me all the good Lux items. I'll count all the Lux items and say how many that we got in the video, but thank you very much for that. Uh, another Lux Lantern Goggles. I think that's almost a full green fit. I want a Lux Spike, please. Oh no, I roll his pants. I'm getting worried because we're getting less and less items. Uh, we got less and less to unlock. Uh, oh, I'll take the Invisibike. That's actually very pog. Thank you very much for that. I really like how the Invisibike looks. Right. Okay, we've got one more page of these. Please give me... Oh, these look different. These look... I like the fade that's going on with these rainbow. It looks so much better than just like a solid rainbow. I like the fade. And then a short one. Oh, that's quite cool. I don't think I've ever seen this one before either. Right. Um, Lux Spike. Oh, no. Uh, please. No. Uh, please. No. Please. Why? Please. What? Please. No, I hate these heads. Why the hell did you have to give me these? I was hoping you wouldn't give me those. Are you joking? I have one more chance to get Lux Spike and you're actually scamming me right now. Thank you for giving me the worst colour Lux Spike in the game. This is... I hate this one. This is the one that Sam Temple got out of the Grand Tour. Actually, we've got one more chance to get another Lux Spike, but at least we got one Lux Spike out of this. Jesus Christ, we got scammed most of the time. Ugh. Actually disgusting. Uh, what are the items that we got out of that? We've also got the Mischief Tour to unlock, uh, which will give us the Missing Material Bike, and also the... This was like for a little contest that they did, get the best photo of a hay bale. Yep, we've got that as well. Right, this is a green item, so that's pretty mid. Uh, tickets please, that's a... Like, um, that's awful. Yeah, that sucks. Wow, that's even worse. Hey, W's. Two Lux Bikes. I'll take two Lux Bikes out of this. That was the only one that you could get an extraordinary item out of. We got two secured Lux Bikes. I think we've got the whole green fit. I think we might be fit missing the bottoms, but full green fit out of the Grand Tour and stuff. Thank you very much for two Lux Bikes and three extraordinary bikes. It's an absolute W. Thank you very much for that indeed. Uh, this one's... Actually, it's a great random des destroyer like camo goggles. They're kind of cool. Uh, this one you don't get anything from. And this is a rare. Of all the... This... I don't understand why they made this a rare and not an extraordinary. But... Uh, the one with the really weird looking arms and the grass blady t-shirt. Right. That is all of the items that we got out of the Grand Tour. Luckily, we secured ourselves two Lux Bikes. Which is very, very nice indeed. A lot of Lux items indeed. Uh, we got ourselves an Invisibike that for some reason is missing the name which I've never actually seen that bug before. Um, I'll take that. It looks very, very cool. And then we've also got ourselves two Lux bikes out of the Grand Tour. Uh, I hate this color. This is my least favorite Lux bike in the game. It just looks so mid. Compared to the, how the green looks, looks really nice. This looks eh, not for me. But yeah, we've got three Lux bikes now. we got a low, we got like basic, do we have a green fit? That's a green one. There's a green one. There's a green one. Oh, we got all of the Lux jerseys. We have every single Lux jersey. Okay, nice. And then, okay, we don't have green bottoms. But we got a bunch of cool items. Um, as this is actually 13 minutes, I didn't realize it was going to be this long. Um, thank you all very much for watching. And I'm going to hand you over to my member screen. Thank you all very much for watching. And thank you to my money havers, Andrew, Grim, Hunter, Luna, James, and I believe that's Perks. If I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong, but I believe that's how you pronounce it. Thank you all very much for supporting the channel. Subscribe for more of this stuff, and I'll see you a lot later. Goodbye.